Hi friends, today's class we are going to discuss the topic Geometry. Geometry is the one of the branch in mathematics like statistics, algebra and coordinate geometry etc. This branch that is geometry first discussed by Euclid. So Euclid is known as the father of geometry. Geometry is the English equivalent Greek word geometron. Geo metron geo meaning earth while metron meaning measurement so geometron meaning i mean geometry meaning earth measurement you know very well euclid famous books that is the element in that element there are three undefined terms in mathematics that three undefined terms are point line and plane these three words are undefined i mean there is no correct definition for the word point, line and plane. Let us discuss first point. Only it is an undefined term. Just you suppose see 3.47. We will say 3 point. What is this point? There is no correct definition. Just we can say a dot. A dot represents a point. Let us see. Say here point A. Here point B. Here point C, etc. Just see we can say a dot represents a point. It represents capital letters. Now let us discuss line segment. Line segment is nothing but joining of two points. Here point A, here point B. Joining of two points with a straight line segment. Straight line segment. Straight. Not curved. So it is called a line segment. It has two end points. Here end point, here also end point. And it has Finite length, suppose here 10 cm or 15 cm. So, line segment has finite length and two end points. Just we can represent this line segment AB or line segment BA. We can write BA or AB, line segment AB or line segment BA. Now, let us discuss the word ray. Already we heard the word sun rays. From here, sun rays will come. From here, rays coming here and from here this starts. So, A and here going on. If there is any object in that here, so this ray will stop here. So, this side will be only shadow. If there is no object, it is going on. What does meaning? From here, this side going on. I mean, here A, here what about here? B. Here end point or initial point this side going on b so ray a b a b so this side going on only one end point one going on extending so ray don't have finite length infinite length going on note the point here o a and here b c and here this side going on eating it here c d here o a a part extending here b c c part extending here c d d part extending o a not equal to a o why because here a part extending what about here o part is in equal no but but line segment we can write a b equal to b a why because it has two end points here no end point which part extending that is correct see here o a a extending not equal to a o is an extending no so this not equal and here c d land ray c d not equal to ray d c is an equal no now let us discuss line Line is nothing but here two side extending. See here B extending, A also extending. So line has no end point. Two side extending. So no end point meaning no finite length. I mean infinite length. Same as it is here PQ. Q extending, P also extending. So this line AB represents AB. This we can write. B A also. Why? Because two side extending. What about down? P Q. 
len PQ equal to len QP also both equal. Why? Because two side extending. Now let us discuss types of lines. There are five types of lines. First one is intersecting lines. Next one parallel lines. Next one perpendicular lines. Now in bisecting lines and last one intersecting and uh, perpendicular lines. First one intersecting line. Suppose one line here PQ. Next line XY. Here two line just uh, touching. That's all. Here line PQ. Next one line XY. Just uh, touching one point. This point is called uh, intersecting point. Just uh, touching. So this line PQ here line XY. These two lines are called uh, Intersecting line. Why? Because here one point touched. This point is called intersecting point. Now let us discuss parallel lines. See here line PQ. Next line XY. These two lines will not intersect. I mean will not touch. Going on with the same distance. So these two lines are called parallel lines. Parallel line is nothing but just not intersecting line. Examples of parallel lines are railway lines. Now let us discuss perpendicular lines. See here one line AB. Next line CD. These two lines intersecting at this point and touching and making an angle 90 degree. Here also 90, 90, 90. So perpendicular is nothing but two lines intersecting and makes an angle 90. Then these two lines are called perpendicular lines. Now let us discuss bisecting lines. See here line segment xy from here to here 4, here to here also 4, total 8. Next line segment pq here to here 3, here to here also 3. What is specialty of these two line segment xy and pq from here to here 8, from here to here 6. This two line segment intersecting point you think it o. This O divide PQ into two equal parts. Similarly, this O divide XY into two equal parts. Here 3, 3, here 4, 4. So, bisecting line is nothing but two line segment touching and dividing into two equal parts. So, these line segments are called the bisecting line segments. Next, we are going to discuss bisecting and perpendicular. All we discussed bisecting. Here C, K, L and N, M. This bisecting means divide into two equal parts. Here also divide into two equal parts. 5, 5, here 4, 4. So it is bisecting. And perpendicular. Perpendicular means makes touching and makes an angle 90 degree. Here N, O, L. How much degree? 90 degree. So here also 90 or 90 degree. So it is bisecting and a perpendicular line divided into two equal parts and makes an angle 90 degree. So let us revise what we are discussed. Today we discussed about geometry. Geometry is the Greek word, two words, geo and metron. Geo means earth and metron means measurement. First discussed by great mathematician Euclid. So Euclid is known as the father of geometry. In that we discussed three undefined terms. The undefined terms are points, lines and plane. These are the undefined terms in the word in the book element. Whose book is that one? Euclid's book. Next we discuss a line segment array and line. Line segment has fixed length two end points while array has no fixed length one side extending one end point while line is two sides extending non fixed length. Next one we discussed the different types of lines. First one is intersecting. Next one parallel. Next one bisecting. Next one perpendicular. Last one perpendicular and bisecting. Intersecting. Just two lines touching. Only one point. This is intersecting lines. And parallel. Not touching. Railway lines. Going on straight. And third one bisecting. Divide into two equal parts. And fourth one perpendicular. Touching and makes an angle 90 degree. And last one, perpendicular and bisecting. Touching equal parts and 90 degree.
Thank you friends for watching this video. Please subscribe, share and forward to your other friends. Thank you.